My name is Jeff Whetstone. I live in Durham and my work is part of Area 919. You're looking at a field in western Nebraska and you're looking at a grasshopper swarm. They don't really make a sound except for the rustling of the, their legs and their wings and in the wheat fields them coming out of a kind of a dry wheat. So you hear a lot of sound. It fills you with a feeling of awe. The, the whole sky becomes alive and you, you feel insignificant once they leave and you can see like the damage they've done to the, the ground and the crops you rot like, wow, those tiny little insects times millions can really like eat the crops to the ground. I think one thing that I want to do in all of my work is to remind myself the power of natural forces is something that we don't necessarily calculate a lot. Not that this picture necessarily does that, but there is an immense power of nature, and I don't know if it's benevolent or destructive, it's certainly intimidating and awesome. One of the things I really wanted to make sure that I referenced was mark making ink on paper, something that looked like a splatter paint or pointillism. The labor involved in making a, a big thing like that by hand, how marks, many, many, many marks can kind of become this awesome composition. So it does relate back to, I think, painting, landscape, abstraction. You know, there's something a little Jackson Pollocky in it. It's kind of got the psychology of abstract expressionism without being at all abstract. But it is expressive, I think.